I'd like to answer it in a slightly different way. I don't believe in equality. I don't believe in equality. I think equality is something we need to get to so we can get to something more important, which is individual merit. And unfortunately, we haven't got equality in the races. We haven't got equality in the sexes. And it's, it's ridiculous that after years and years, we're still battling for that stuff. You know, me being a white middle-aged male, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm supposedly at the top of the tree in, in that. And so equality is, equality is something, unfortunately, we still need to get right. But more importantly than equality, we need to be able to see someone for the skills and the things they bring, regardless of who they are because then you're, you're getting the most value out of that individual and who knows who they could be. So uh, one of my team is disabled um, and I am so pleased that he's in the team because he does all the stuff much better than I could do and he does all the stuff I hate doing and he's brilliant at it. And the fact that he's disabled is actually irrelevant. We have to make some considerations but I, I, I have regular conversations where I'm, I'm supporting able-bodied members of my team who are stressed out with their kids and they are, they've got problems in life too. So to me, it's like, well, everyone's got, everyone's got things they need to deal with. Um, and yeah, it's interesting to me. It's, 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 it's irrelevant that he's disabled. We just have to make consideration when he's in the office because he needs, he needs a different setup. But he's he's actually just really valuable. Yeah, I always uh, told employers that sometimes it's important to fit the job to the person instead of fitting the person to the job, right? Oh, I, I would say that for anybody, <laughs> absolutely anybody, because you want the best individual you can get. And they may be in a wheelchair. Who cares? <laughs> you yeah. know, it's, it's, who cares? Diversity of perspective is very important, isn't it? <laughs> it's, well, that's why you hire a team. And that's what back to leadership, because there's this crazy thing saying there is no I in team. Well, there's no I in the word, but every person in a team is an individual. And that's what makes a team strong. It's also its biggest weakness if the leaders and the managers can't glue them together to work well. But you want individuals, you want people who think differently, different backgrounds, different thoughts, different ways, different skills, everything. So it's down to the leaders to be able to mold this into a team because it's like having a, a soccer team or you know, a hockey team and everyone has exactly the same skill set. Well, they'll get beaten every week, wouldn't they? So you need that diversity. So to, yeah, that, to me, it's like, it's an interesting question about inclusion, about diversity, but to me, it's almost like, yeah, let's looks well, hopefully I'm practicing what I preach. I'm looking for the individual. I'm not looking for equality.